There's a pair of Sennheiser Momentum 4 wireless headphones. I'm going to show you how to pair and connect this directly to your Sony TV. This is the Sony TV that has Google TV. First thing is go to the settings on your Sony TV. You can click on the settings uh, button on your remote or you can just go to the home screen and then go all the way up to the top right. So go up to the settings icon on the right. So I'm going to go all the way over right there and then you can see my avatar there and this little settings icon there now. Let's click on that. Let's go all the way down here to remotes and accessories right there. Let's click on OK on the remote. Make sure that Bluetooth is turned on. And now we're going to go down to pair accessory. OK, and as soon as we click on that, OK, now it's searching for um, Bluetooth devices in pairing mode. So let's grab our headphones here and let's go ahead and put this into pairing mode. So here's the button here. Let me go ahead and press and hold and wait until I see all the lights. Oh, let me turn it off first. Okay, so I just turned it off. Now I'm going to turn it off. I'm going to press and hold. I got It says press and hold this button for like five seconds, but I typically have to hold it to eight seconds. Just hold it until you see all the lights like flashing. There it is right there. Now let go. And now it just spotted it right there, Momentum 4. Now you want to grab your remote and go down to Momentum 4 right there. Click on OK, and then it's going to be pairing. We should get a pairing request shortly here. Oh, there it is right there, Bluetooth pairing request, and it's highlighted on pair. I'm going to click OK on the remote, and it, the headphones just said it's connected, okay? And so it's connected down there, and you can see right here, accessories right there, Momentum 4. Now I can go ahead and use these to watch uh, Netflix or YouTube or whatnot, all right? Pretty simple. Good luck, guys. Oh, if you guys have issues uh, where you couldn't connect or pair, you can just factory reset these as well. Look in the link below, uh, in the description below. I'll show you how to factory reset these, okay? Good luck, guys.